Welcome to GW Solar USA and uh, these are the batteries we have um, 100 LFB 3.2 volts 25 amp top band lithium batteries so these batteries you've guys seen before and we've done experiments on them you will see uh, if I can zoom you can see all my parallel or series connection BMS configurations that we did and I've been in the process of collecting these batteries the way battery hookup you can find these batteries at batteryhookup.com hookup.com and uh, don't forget to use my affiliate code on the description below to have the 5% uh, discount when you buy batteries so um these batteries came yes uh a while it has been sitting there for a while the one on the box right there and uh we just want to open them up and see what we have and what came in and uh stay tuned for that like and subscribe jw solar usa all right fellows let's go ahead and open up these batteries um see what we got because I've been trying to hunt these batteries the way uh, battery hookup had it before and it's not easy anymore the way you know it used to I can buy in boxes so this is just by an accident which is like coincident and they posted the batteries and all of a sudden the batteries I didn't know and time I saw them I contacted them and uh, all of a sudden it's only seven remaining so I bought the seven and uh, I went back in the evening just at work, I was checking the site, and all of a sudden, so one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, so I ordered one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, these are the first ones I ordered, when I saw them, I, I grabbed as much as I can, but all of a sudden, it's gone. You know, can't be that deal. 15 bucks by battery. So, came back. The next day, they posted and they're gone again. I'm trying to grab as much as I can. What I have is this one. One, two, three, four, five. It's only five I can able to get and they're out. Hot cake. Can't believe that and the batteries went too fast. And um, then I called, and they said, "Oh, they said just a um, just a small amounts they have, and uh, and I think they posted twenty five. And somebody who's desperate more than I do, or more than me, um, end up buying the batteries, cut them into half or whatever." So I end up getting whatever I got. So these are the cells. If you look at them, it's the same. LFP 3.225 amp. And if you look at these ones here, it's the same as well. And let me zoom you in. I can see them. See that 3.2 25 amp hours that's all I have set up there so each battery is uh, 25 amp hours so now we just add 7 8 9 10 11 12 of them here so if you do the math 25 times 
102 batteries. You tell me the number at this 3.2 volt. Okay. So if we calculate these batteries correctly and put them into a string like what I've done over there. So each string is wired in four, but four in series and five in parallel. So I was trying to get another 20 batteries because um, five, 10, 15, 20, I was trying to get 20 batteries back on these guys. So this string right here is already 48 volt. So I can pair um, series that one as well and make it a, um, a 60 volt. So I just have to regulate the, temp, uh, the, the voltage the way I want it to work for my system because my inverter can go all the way 64 and 66 high, my outback, the input. So I can able to do that, but I can able to leave it at 64 and tune the battery down, can charge it all away. So you increase the amps. So drop the voltage a little bit. So this is how I've been working and been doing this system. And we have more of these that just showed up. And um, I have, doesn't come with the, um, the nuts, but I got some I purchased the last time so I wish battery cup can just have them like the way they are they, they used to you know you can buy boxes of them you can buy 12 you can buy 24 like you call it one old carton you know one old cardboard in 24s or something so well, these are the batteries and guys, just an additional. And I was so disappointed and I uh, thought I can have completed this. I was gonna have uh, two strings of um, 48 volt. But anything that works for me, it works. I just wanna get this one another 20 again, but I have 12. So, six more to go i can able to um do what i want to do and i can have two for 24 volts i can do two of these in series and two of that in series on 24 volt okay so 125 amp hour each so 125 125 when series series the amperage drop voltage goes up so 125 125 125 125 right there so 12 volts is a big benefit okay so over 500 amps but over but in um 24 volt series so two of these already become uh, 125 amp hour battery 125 amp hour battery which is uh 250 already i got if two this guy this one is completed and that one so that give me another so here are the rest of the batteries that came so i took them off from the bags and all stuff and this is how they did i think the shrink wrap they put on the t terminals so that the terminals cannot touch each other so same specs here See, some of them are reading 3.297, 3.297, and uh, likewise, other ones do hit 3.297. I think they came all balanced. Yeah, so they have them on their machine, make sure everything is charged, and send them is the same as these guys here. So these are the ones I use, the first ones I built. And um, been sitting for quite a long time. I stopped talking about them like probably months and months ago. So let's see the voltage. So just gonna hook it up direct like this. 
You know, we have to go diagonally. It's still sitting at uh, thirteen point three two. So if I take this probe and put it in the extreme corner, it's gonna still read the same. Three point three thirteen point three two. So let's go back here. So holding a charge, and the charge doesn't go anywhere. I don't remember what I have them the last time. So, okay, this will be negative here. Stick it right there. And put this guy right on the spot. Thirteen point nine one. So they're all balanced. So these are the batteries and uh, just want to show you the progress we've made collecting these batteries. I need more of these batteries more than ever. So this is the deal. So I'm looking for opening for battery hookup and uh, found them somewhere where I used to buy batteries, this um, uh, vendor I used to buy battery from, not too far away from me here in Minnesota. Well, I'm gonna see what they need, what they want for the batteries. I think is too expensive compared to battery hookup, and they put uh, a shipping thing on that as well, which is ridiculous to ship one cell, one cell, just this. The battery is expensive and they charge you per battery. If they wanna ship it, they charge you per battery. So, which is really, really stupid compared to, in my opinion, compared to what battery hookup is doing, where they are doing a fantastic job. Thank you so much, Ryan. And this is really cool. Stay tuned. Like and subscribe. JW Solo USA, live from Minnesota.